Have you ever been inside the temple of elemental evil? Game Master's here, and chances are that if you started playing Dungeons & Dragons in its 5th edition version, you've probably never played the temple of elemental evil. It originally came out in 1985 for Advanced Dungeons & Dragons. The overall storyline was fairly straightforward. Uh, you and your party are in a village called Hamlet, only to discover a sinister plot of evil wanting to take over the lands. The adventure eventually leads you into the Temple of Elemental Evil itself, where a group of denizens are trying to free the demoness uh, uh, Zuckmoy. Goodman Games uh, has updated, uh, or well, reincarnated rather, this adventure for 5th edition. And if they're not on your radar, they really should be, as they have also converted many other classic advanced Dungeons Dragons modules into 5th edition. What's more, this, uh, this, this tome comes in two parts. Okay, the original T1 adventure, The Village of Hamlet, came out in 1979. It acted as a standalone adventure and took place in the world of Greyhawk. Then, six years later, T1 through T4 was released under the name of Temple of Elemental Evil, which incorporated that original Hamlet adventure. This updated for 5th edition volume, uh, you notice, is in two books. Actually, contains the original Village of Hamlet adventure, as well as the original Temple of Elemental Evil, as well as the converted 5th edition version. There is is a page in mine that says if you're enjoying this video to please give it a thumbs up it helps to spread this out to more eyes and I thank you kindly for that uh, your your copy may not have that page included Moreover, these books are about 350 pages each, and they didn't use uh, cheap 20 pound copy paper within. Now this, this stuff feels very much like a good thick quality 70 pound paper. It doesn't jump directly into the adventure, but instead the first 45 pages provides a bit of history, including original drawings and maps, and the original pitch for the Temple of Elemental Evil. And it also explains how the editing process took place, even delving into how they addressed errors, uh, inconsistencies, and, and, and typos, in the original version of the module. The original T1 Village of Hamlet module starts on page 46 of this book. Page 78 begins the Temple of Elemental Evil adventure as it originally appeared in 1985. Starting on page 225 is the beginning of the 5th edition conversion and continues through to page 725. Keep in mind that these two books are comprised as a volume, so the page numbers are continuous from the first book into the second book. And this all means that the original version of The Village of Elemental Evil covered a total of 147 pages, whereas the 5th edition counterpart covers a whopping 500 pages. Maps are included, and as best I can tell, the original artwork appears in their respective locations as they did in the original version. And the artwork in the 5th edition conversion does very well in presenting that older look and feel. Goodman Games does not send out review copies. Yeah, I asked. So I purchased this on my own to provide this review. At the time I'm recording this, it's listed at $53.84, which is 46% off the manufacturer's suggested retail price of $99. And I'll leave a link down below in the description as to where you can purchase this. One thing to note, this thing is heavy, uh, but the shipping for me was free and I got it within five days of purchase. There have been other attempts at updating this classic adventure to the fifth edition, but this one by far wins the Cupid doll from me, mainly because of the presentation of the original version, the in-depth history presented within, and just the sheer weight of the two books. And well, to be honest, the nostalgia that it conjures up. I'm quite impressed by this reincarnation. The Temple of Elemental Evil has always been, and thanks to Goodman Games, is still currently one of the best Dungeons & Dragons adventures out there. And it goes without say that I highly recommend this version. Now, I'd love to grab more books and modules from Goodman Games if they're anywhere close to the quality and presentation of uh, how this book is presented, how this tome of Elemental Evil is, is presented. Getting them would be a no-brainer. Have you played with any of their converted to 5th edition books? Have you played this 5th edition version of Temple of Elemental Evil? Tell me about it down in the comments, uh, and if you have played this, Give a tiny hint as to what nasty areas to avoid. And until next our paths cross, may you find the ring of water walking on area 19.